evil. Oh. Hi everyone. This is my uh, welcome back to the channel. This is my uh, latest custom figure, Ashley Graham from Resident Evil 4. So again, everything is pretty much sourced. All the clothing, I mean, is sourced from uh, AliExpress. The boots, the tights, the dress, the skirt, and the shirt, and the blazer. All from AliExpress, but I did have to dye the dye them in different colour because I couldn't find the right colours. So what I'd done with the um so the skirt was like white bits. We had the checkered bit, but it was white. So what I'd done, I dipped it in a bit of green and it gave it the perfect colour pretty much then. Just in and out quick. And then with the jacket that was I think it was dark blue. Well no it wasn't, it was green. A dye what takes the colour out, and I took most of the colour of the green out, and then dyed it orange. And the top was all right. The top was on the 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 sweatshirt underneath was orange anyway. So the head, the phone, and the lantern, and the little necklace on her. That all came from Colts 3D. I think the barrel did as well. And this pistol, I just had a pistol lying around. I can't remember where I got that from. You can't even see it anyway, so there's a pistol there. So anyway, this kind of pretty much concludes my Resident Evil 4 figures now. So this is the last one. So I've done all the rest already. Like Obviously Leon I brought from Resident Evil 4 because you can buy him. I've got three chainsaw guys. Or two girls and a guy. Um, I custom made an Ada Wong. And I custom made a Jack Krauser. And now I've custom made. Uh, Ashley Graham. And I think that would do for Resident Evil 4. I'll give you a close look at her anyway. So this uh, head. I'm not 100% happy with it. To be honest. She looks a bit dully. Like a doll. She looks a little bit like a doll, but hey ho, that's the best head I could find. And my painting is not the best, so it is what it is, isn't it? So the lantern was a full size lantern, which I shrunk down to uh, 112 scale roughly. And like I say, the dress was uh, these, the green bits were basically white. So what I'd like I I just dipped it in a bit of green literally for about five seconds I took it out and it left it like that. So so we kept them other lines in, which is fairly accurate to the film. And then you got the boots and the tights. Oh, I think she came out not too bad. This blaze is a bit kind of creased and stuff where I kind of had to dye it. But you know, it's the closest I can get anyway. There we go, that's it really. You know, if you look at her face quickly. Layers.